And last week for Inspire Today, you might remember we introduced you to Rokesha. She was nominated by her daughter, Kwan Yell, after she actually lost her home, but still continued to put others before herself. Well, now she's in a new home, and a big thanks to Gardner White for donating furniture to their new home, and an entire room, in fact, and also two new mattresses for mom and daughter. And this week, we want to introduce you to someone who's equally as special, a man by the name of Tom, who is the father of a special needs son, and he never Never complains about his struggles in life. This morning, we're all the way up in Howell, and I'm joined by Joyce. You nominated your godson, your nephew, Tom, for Inspire Today. Tell me a little bit about Tom. So, Tom, my nephew, my godson, is the father of Tommy, who is um, a fairly disabled child in a wheelchair, and both of them are my heroes. And Tommy, the, the younger one, is, is dealing with a condition. Yes, he has cerebral palsy. Everything works. Um, he's trapped inside of a body that doesn't work. He has one leg that works right. He points with that. He says yes and no with that. So it, you know, just provides a lot of challenges. But these, this family overcomes them all. And he's been overcoming this for 17 years 17 now. Years. Uh, Tom had him at a young age. He um, had him while he was still in high school. He gave up high school. He gave up college. He's taken care of him since day one. They are at home right now because yes. uh, the other kids are getting ready for school. So we yes. should probably head over there. Yes, let's go. Real soon. Yes, let's okay. go. I'm ready. So this is their house over here. Surprise! Are you Tom? Well, I'm Everett Casimir, as I mentioned, from Channel 4, and we are here to inspire today. Your godmother, your aunt, wrote a, a very nice letter about you and wanted to uh, let her read it. My godson, Tommy Masters, and his family. Tom had a son when he was very young, and as it turned out, Tommy had cerebral palsy, and he was severely disabled. The young mother just really couldn't bear the burden of it, and Tommy took custody. He is such a good person. I get choked up every time I talk about it. When you talk about heroes, when you talk about people that come into your life, these two men, these two young men, make me a better person. Why have you been been so upbeat? Because this would be challenging for, for most people. It's just the card that I was dealt. Well, we are here to inspire today, as I mentioned. Our friends at College Funding 123, they help people find money from grants to scholarships. They want to donate their services to you guys and help you find the money to get him to college. That would be awesome. College Funding 123 also wants you guys to go out to a Pistons game and enjoy a night out. You've got floor seats, six of them, to the Pistons. <laughs> That's awesome. Our friends over at the Red Wings want to invite you guys out to a game as well. They're also going to be sending you some autograph memorabilia. There are two restaurants down the street on Grand River. One's called Diamond Steak and Seafood. The other one's called Mr. B's. And they want to invite you out for dinner, $100 at each restaurant so that you can bring your family. That makes me, that's really cool. What does Tommy mean to you? A lot of different things. He's, uh, I love him, he inspires me. He's happy with how he is. So I'm fine with that if he is. Such a great wow. dad. It so really is. And, and then get this, just after uh, we met with them, just after we shot that, the Tigers called me and they also offered tickets to an upcoming game, obviously after uh, opening day, which is happening very soon. So he, they want their family to come out. So big thanks to the Tigers, the Red Wings, College Funding 123, Diamond Steak and Seafood, and Mr. B's Rustic Tavern and Howell. Uh, just so many people being so generous. He has you know? sacrificed so much mm -hmm. that, you know, it is so, so well deserved. We need more dads like that. Yeah. We certainly do. And this is your opportunity. We love sharing stories like this of Metro Detroiters. So if you'd like to nominate someone for Inspire today, just go to clickondetroit.com and go to the community tab right there at the top, and you can submit a letter for Inspire today. We read them all, and we get a lot of them. Well, we are certainly inspired by him. Definitely.